now it's time to start with start exploring relationships between variables let's begin with correlation what is correlation in statistics so correlation measures the strength and direction of a linear relationship between two continuous variables continuous variables it ranges from minus 1 to 1 where minus 1 indicates a perfect negative correlation 0 indicates no correlation and 1 indicates a perfect positive correlation hold on hold on i know it would be too or too much it would be overwhelming to you giving all the information at one stretch but I ju uh, it's just you know surface level i just want to tell you what is correlation but i'm just going to take you through step by step into the correlation what is co space relation so let's begin with what is correlation correlation refers to the statistical relationship between the two entities normally these two entities are continuous variables it measures the extent to which two variables are linearly related for example the height and the weight of a person are related and taller people tend to be heavier than shorter people okay so you can apply correlation to a variety of data sets in some cases you may be able to predict how things will relate while in others the relation will come as a complete surprise it's important to remember that just because something is correlated doesn't mean it's causal causal correlation and causation there are two things one is called correlation and other one is causation so, okay so it's important it's important to remember that just because something is correlated doesn't mean it's causal it's causal it's causal okay now uh, it's time to explore uh, types of uh, correlation there are three types of correlations the first one pause the first one you can see on the screen a positive correlation means that this a linear relationship is positive and two variables increase or decrease in the same direction in the same direction whether they increase or decrease in the same direction that's why it's called positive correlation because it's positively correlated if it goes up uh, if x goes up y also goes up if y if x goes down y also goes down so y is y is positively correlated with the x so that's the reason we call them as a positive correlation if you want to see the animation one more time yes you see that you know this point x comma y as x is growing y is also growing uh, as x is growing y is growing x is growing y is growing so basically they are positively correlated and this is called a positive correlation on other side we have second type of correlation in this case uh, uh, the relationship line has a negative slope and the variables change in opposite directions that's one variable decreases while the other increases if you see x is increasing in this example let me put it yes this is called the negative correlation let me reanimate this one for you and as x is increasing uh, y is decreasing so y is inversely proportional to x you see that x is increasing and y is decreasing x is increasing y is in decreasing so this kind of uh, a negative relation this kind of inversely proportional uh, between the two variables are known uh, uh, if they are that kind of relation is called a negative correlation it's called a negative correlation and then 
the third one it's very simple no correlation no cor no correlation simply means that the variables behave very differently and thus have no re linear relationship at all so the variable y and x there is no connection there is no dependency on each of them neither positive neither in directly proportional nor inversely proportional they'll take up the random values they don't uh, dependent on each other so that kind of relation is known as co no correlation no correlation reanimate it see somewhere randomly those are getting placed so this is what we call it as no correlation 